हेलो फ्रेंड्स लेट अस नाउ लर्न सम इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स अबाउट फॉरेन बॉडी एस्पिरेशन दिस फॉरेन बॉडी एस्पिरेशन इज मोर कॉमनली सीन इन ओल्डर एंड इन्फेंट्स एंड चिल्ड्रन इट इज कॉमन इन ओल्डर इन्फेंट्स एंड टॉडलर्स मेनली द मोस्ट कॉमन ऑब्जेक्ट्स कैन बी फूड कॉइन बेलून एंड टॉयस मे बी मे मे बी यू नो दे मे अंडर गो Uh, obstruction in our respiratory tract one third of these objects are nuts and particularly among these peanuts are more common in the children and the most serious complication of foreign body aspiration is complete obstruction of airway this can even lead to death if we do not um, uh, remove it immediately then if you see the clinical features of foreign body aspiration in the clinical features the this includes three stages one there will be initial event in initial event just after aspiration the baby presents with violent coughing choking and gagging sensation immediately and followed by asymptomatic interval if the foreign body is lodged then this fatigue will be removed relieved so the fat fatigue that the child experience in the initial event will be relieved in the asymptomatic interval and irritating sy symptoms will also be subside and there that means there won't be any issue in asymptomatic interval and later the third stage is complications this complications in this stage there will be obstruction of the foreign body in the airway and this leads to the slowly this can cause erosion of the side walls leading to direct infection of the agent other complications like fever cough hemoptysis pneumonia and atelectasis can also occur then diagnosis is uh first diagnosis the the one important thing the highly suggestive thing is that just after eating if there is choking episodes or coughing episodes along with accompanying wheeze this is suggestive of foreign body aspiration then radiograph or x ray if you take this is normal in almost 15 to 30% of cases ct scan may help the patients if there is opaque foreign body is ingested only in 10 to 25% of cases if you see prompt we should in the treatment we should do rigid bronchoscopy and you should remove the foreign body with the help of this rigid bronchoscopy thank you guys for watching.